Hello, welcome back once again. Here we go. We are now ready to present the origin or the actual structure of our file folders, directories, and this analysis is without fallacies. I know I've written fallacies at the top there, but I think it will be related somehow to fallacies as well in terms of addressing it. So I promise to actually, uh, you know, analyze the data, you know, in terms of uh, bits, binary bits, uh, byte and kilobyte because we have looked at all of them in the previous video and we have tackled the digital data in binary system and then we look at the bits and we also took a look at bytes and we also looked at the kilobyte you know and we looked at the fallacies which are there already and in bits uh, the fallacies are that people look at bits as the storage. Uh, they don't consider it as the un the, 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 sm the smallest or the, the basic unit of the actual data that the system uh, processes at a given time. <clears throat> and then after processing appeared or uh, sent to somewhere you know, to be kept temporarily um, when the computer is turned off. And then, <clears throat> excuse me, people talk of bytes in terms of uh, 8 bits without actually considering byte as a standard for encoding a character by using 8 bits. And then kilobyte, uh, they look at kilobyte in, in, the, in the decimal format rather than looking at it in terms of uh, binary. And in most cases, um, a lot of resources out there, you know, point kilobyte to 1000 bytes instead of pointing kilobyte to 1024 byte and their basis for reasoning is that because 1024 is only 2.4 percent higher than 1000 therefore kilobyte is approximately 1000 bytes but to me as a computer scientist that's why i'm here to correct you guys a kilobyte is equivalent to 1024 byte because that 1024 byte is got or is found by using the combination of 10 bits with the binary base 2 system in order to get that yes you may look at it as a decimal number but it's not the ordinary decimal which is found from anyhow anywhere is a decimal found from the binary systems only you know base two and the bits that is why it is that unique you know 